Hi everybody, it is Matthew of Mr. Domestic here at the Fat Quarter Shop Studio to introduce all of you to English paper piecing, also known as EPP. These are some of my favorite notions that I use and I'm sharing them with you, hope, hoping that you will also get started in it. This is a great type of sewing because it's a scrap buster. All of that extra fabric that you have, you can now use. So that's what this is. This is from my new catch and release collection that's coming and shipping in June. Okay, so I love Deco Bob thread for English paper piecing. It's my preference. I, I highly feel that you should use a polyester thread. It won't break. This one, it doesn't tingle and it glides well. And then in this Violet Craft Wonder Fill box, it comes with the three colors. Because essentially with the stitch that I'm gonna show in some of the other videos, you want it to melt into the background of the intersection of the two fabrics. So depending on the value that you use would determine which one that you stitch with. And, whoa. Okay, if you've never seen or known about thimble pads, this is going to blow your mind. Whenever I first started, I didn't use a thimble, I didn't know, and the needles would like, the back of the needle would poke holes in my finger. And like, I don't have sensation in them now, so I'm okay, but um, I still don't want holes in them, but um, it just sticks on there and you can reuse it over and over and over again, and then you won't get holes. You'll need some papers. I suggest if you've never English paper piece to get the one inch hexagon. Those are ubiquitous and you, there's so much you can do with it. It's so diverse and you don't have to do a lot of thinking. You can just grab the fabric, prepare these and start stitching at random, which I'll show you the beautyosity of that in a little bit. I prefer milliner needles. I like the eight. I like that because I don't know if my finger muscles are just so strong, but it, um, if I go thinner, then I have a tendency to bend those needles and they don't last as long. But if you have a lighter touch than I do, then you can go with a nine or a 10. But I really like Bohen for the value. And then this thread cutters ring, you don't have to bring scissors with you because it's already, honestly, it's a few notions, right? That you're all gonna have with you that having this on your hand ready to cut that thread, that it eliminates the potential of you accidentally sitting on scissors, which I'm not gonna say I've done before, but I have. Okay, I said it. <laughs> so these are my favorite notions for English paper piecing. So I would say order all these. I'll wait. I'm kidding. Order them, then come back and watch my other videos and we can have some EPP fun together. So keep it positive.